Uh, the first set we're going to talk about is cross side. That means his right hand is going to grab my right hand. Most bad guys are going to be focused in this area. So if I try to fight it here, you're gonna, it's going to be very difficult for you to get out of that position. So the first thing I need to do is change their focus. That would be by hitting the guy. Hi, I can hit him immediately on their knees, on their knee. And then we're going to continue with the movement. Most people, when they get hit, they want to escape and they're going to release. This is why when I hit this guy, I want to stay on his hand. And then I'm going to turn my right hand where I want his hand to stay in this position. That's the Z. I need to bring his hand to this position. So from here, I'm going to turn. And I'm going to bring his hand to this position. Then I'm going to pressure down on his wrist area and take him all the way down. Get down, get down, get down, get down, get down. And we're going to stand here. Okay? Okay, so we're showing you this from a different angle. Bad guy with his right hand, grab my right hand. If I wait, you're going to get punched in your face with the other hand. So immediately I'm going to go ahead and I have change their focus, or I can go ahead and head down on their knee. Left hand is going to come back and trap his thumb and his index finger, so he's not going to escape. I'm going to bring my right hand all the way over. I'm just going to make a quick circle here. I'm exaggerating this movement here. Out and stay on his wrist so I can go down and cause him some pain. So I'm going to come out all the way. I would like this arm to be bent. If I go straight down and the arm is straight, there's, gonna, there's, there's not going to be a lot of pain. So I'm going to have this hand bent or their, or their arm is bent. Then all the way down, get down, get down, get down, get down. Then I'm going to take him down. 